This is question 17 of the 2009 KCP paper. Um, this is the same, it kind of takes the same um, route as the other questions that we've discussed so far, which are kind of of the form, what is the value and you have to, you're given a sum to um, solve. But this also includes some algebra because we're asked to find what is the value of x in this equation. So um, when we're looking to solve any kind of algebraic equation, we're looking to isolate x. So have on either on the left hand side or the right hand side, have just x and have everything else on the other side so we can find out what the value of x is. So um, that means if we see a plus 6 here, um, we need to subtract plus 6 from both sides to get rid of that so we can isolate x. Okay, so let's start. So I think that will be our first move to subtract 6 on both sides. So if we're subtracting 6 because it's a because it's an equation, if we do something on one side, we have to do it on the other side, so that they're both equal, so, they, so that both sides of the equation remain equal. So um, since we're subtracting 6 on one side, on the right-hand side we will get 4, um, 10 minus 6 is 4, and on this other side we will remove the 6 that we had there, so we'll end up with 2 thirds, 2 to the 2x plus 4. And then what we want to do is get rid of this bit. As, as we said before, we're trying to isolate x, have x on its own, so we can work out what the value of x is. So um, this is 2 over 3. So um, let's first multiply by 3 on both sides. So we get um, this. Uh, so that's 4 times by 3. Uh, which, okay, so we get 4 primes by 3, which is the same as 12 um, on this side. And then let's get rid of this um, 2 here. So to get rid of that 2, we will divide by 2. So we get 12 divided by 2, which is equal to 6. And then we can... Ignore these brackets that we were using before on this side. Um, let me move this up here so you can see it a bit better. Right, so our next step, we're very close. We've got 2x plus 4. So our next steps will probably be to uh, subtract by 4 and then to divide by 2 so we get x on its own. So uh, first subtracting by 4, we get 2x equals 6 minus 4. 6 minus 4 is 2. We can rewrite that as 2. Then we've got, then we need to divide through um, both sides by 2 so we can get x on its own so we just have x. So x equals 2 divided by 2 which is the same as 1. So the answer is x equals 1. So the answer is d.